If you are looking for something to do with your friends after work or on the weekends, there is a new place you may want to try. And the hope is this business could help revitalize a key part of Greenwood. Carlos joins us now to talk about a new spot that offers up axe throwing. And Carlos, I also saw you had a growler of beer, so connect the dots for us. <laughs> Yeah, it does it. You got to have the growler, you know, this early in the morning. But we're here at the Hoosier Brewing Company. It's Tap and Axe here in Greenwood. You can see this is where all the action takes place. The founder is with us, Brian, right now. And so, Brian, what are we looking at back here with these two things here? We have a mash tun right here, and that's basically where the grain goes in, converted to a sugar water that we call wort. Uh -huh. It goes from that over to the brick boil kettle. It, and it's all about making beer. So you're making the beer back here, here. And then we walk, let's, let's walk over here to this room, because, and this building, that it's in, this is Old Town Greenwood. This building is over a hundred years old. Okay, let's keep walking. Historic building, yeah. So we have this area here. So what are we looking at right here? After after the beer is boiled over there or the wort is boiled, they come over to the fermenters. This is where the beer goes for about a week. Okay, forgive me for asking, but I mean this looks like some pretty heavy duty equipment. I mean look how big these yeah, are. Sizable. I mean we're talking this is like about a hundred thousand, this is over a hundred thousand dollars worth of equipment here. A good investment here. <laughs> Lots of volume too. So each one of these you can put about forty kegs in most of these worth of beer at a time and then in a couple weeks they're ready to start packaging and put on on tap for customers to take okay so basically we're, we're in old town greenwood we're, we're right off of madison avenue and main street so you have these things here that are making the beer so right. this is this is you know what you call a brewery but then walk right in here this is look at this you have the bar here yep. so you have a bar uh that is you know the hoosier brewing company now you guys opened very recently yep. correct just just before christmas so we had a couple days of trial and error here, so we're ready to get rocking and rolling. <laughs> and then how many taps do you have back here? We have 30 taps, and right mm -hmm. now we've got about 14, 15 of those filled, so we have our work ahead of us. Uh, right now, all of these beers are ours. We also have kombucha, which is a unique fermented tea product. Oh, okay. So it's a, it's like a, it's a beer tea combination kind of thing. So you have your bar here, and like I said, this building, you can see you had to rip out all of the plaster that was in this building before? Yep. So it was, it was called the Blind Pig, and it had like 10 foot ceilings and we didn't even know if it had the space for our tanks so yeah after those ceilings came out we have some awesome woodwork up there some really cool brick <laughs> that we that we discovered so and then finally last but not least and I'm going to be showing you guys this a little bit later this morning you cannot have a true axe room without axe throwing and Dustin and Julia coming up later this morning I'm going to give this a try and we throw in some axes right over here at these targets right over here so it's like bowling for the 21st century guys back to you <laughs> yeah, what, what could go wrong? Yeah. <laughs> Beer and axe throwing. All right, Carlos, thank you. But